Stephen. What puzzles me is you knitting that cardigan. I'm not knitting. It's my hands busy. Well, if you're unhappy. Oh, well, he likes my cardigans. He can't get a decent fit in the bought ones. And then I do think a bit of nice wool, real wool, you know, properly knitted up, keeps out the cold much better than all that artificial stuff. You said he got on your nerves. Oh, I didn't get on my nerves. Well, you said... No, I mean, it's just this present trouble of his, you know, these pills and his urges. Well, I don't mind saying I could no more have done a thing like that for mine and fly to the moon. Proper pest he was. Mm. Entertaining all his nasty friends and all them dirty vests and pants he used to leave hanging about for me to wash. Oh, I wouldn't like that. Oh, I don't like dirt, no. Cleanliness is next to godliness. Not that I'm religious. I'd have my lot in the end. 21 years waiting on that pest and no thanks, and I thought, right, I'm entitled to my peace and quiet and a few nice holidays. Yeah. And those powders went and let me down. Powders? Pest powders. It's a bit drastic, would not it? Well, my last resort, I don't mind telling you. Then the fool goes and sicks them out. Oh, what a good thing. What do you mean? Well, you don't know nothing about it. But if he hadn't sicked them up, I wouldn't be here, would I? I'm not sure I follow you. If he hadn't sicked them up, I'd have been enjoying my crowd life, my holidays at South End. Oh, oh Edna. Oh, I don't believe you. You couldn't do a thing like that. Well, I mean, it's... It, what? But he couldn't. I mean, that's awful. Oh, I see. So now it's awful, is it? I'm sorry, I didn't know. Getting on hoity-toity, are we? No, no. It's nothing to do with me. Stage, I would not. Who do you think you are? I'm a businesswoman. I'd like to know the kind of business that you run. You're nothing but a pity thief. A bloody convict, just like the rest of you. Mrs. Leckworth, how could you? 